Hey everybody, welcome to a behind the scenes look at Quiz Show, the funnest game on the planet. Uh, we're gonna show you how to set up the, the wireless buzzers, uh, the, or the crowd buzzers. So I'm gonna turn that, uh, that logo loop off right now. Uh, so what you would do is to set up, you can play this over, uh, you can use a, a phone or any device really that has access to the internet. So just go to ccg.buzz, just go to that, that domain, ccg.buzz, and click on host a new game. So when you go to there, you'll just type in, we call this Trivia Night, Trivia Night, and hit uh, Begin. So that's going to give me a room code, and then uh, so I can just tell my whoever's wanting to play along, go, hey guys, just go to ccg.buzz, and go to, uh, well, they would see this, I say, when you get there, click Join a Game, and then just type in the room code, 58... MW. My name is Brad. And then I'm going to say my team name. Uh, my team name is I'm on team one. Uh, and I'm going to hit join. Now, when I do that, it's going to give me the option here. So you can see I've got this big buzzer here. And when I click buzz, it's going to buzz me in right there. And I can see that happening. If I want to turn it off, I can click off right there. And it's right there. So you can, it's just that easy to get it all set up and be plain. And it's it's a free service. And so now here's a, here's a little little extra thing that we did just for you guys. So now for quiz show, if someone, if say this happens, I ask a question. So I say, um, what should you do if you're attacked by a pack of clowns? I would then turn the buzzer on because that way the players would then have the option to buzz in. They would, uh, they would click on buzzed. I would see team one buzzed in and then I could click on the number one here or the keyboard one. And then the, I can say, all right, team one, it looks like Brad from team one, because I'm just looking at the trivia night here, uh, you are, uh, you can answer. So if you're on Zoom, you could, you know, open their mic, or if you're at a, a public place, you can say, hey, where's Brad at? You know, we find him. And then uh, they could answer if they're correct, they get the points, and we go back to the game board. So that's a way, if, the reason we have the team there is so you could play with teams of people instead of just players, so that way you could have, there's only... 10 teams, so you could have 10 people on each team, so you could have 100, uh, 100 people playing, and it would be a whole lot of fun. Now, what happens is, th this is where it gets a little bit tricky, is I'm now going to turn that off, and then this is off here, and I've got to go back over to this game here, ask the question, then once I ask the question, then I've got to go back over here, turn this on, and then someone can buzz in. So that, that's a lot of work to, you know, you're constantly going from this screen, back to this screen, back to this screen, back to this screen. It would be great if someone else could do that on a different computer. So what we've done is, uh, Brian is a genius. So he made, if you go to ccg.buzz forward slash show, so that right here in this top uh, Chrome window, if you do that and type in the same game code, 58MW and hit join, what this is, you'll see, you can see it's still trivia night. It's the same, uh, it's the same game, but there's no on-off button here. This is just a, uh, it's just the preview. It's, all this is is just the leaderboard preview right here. So this all could be happening. Everything from here could be happening on my phone or on a different computer. And when I turn the buzzers off, turn back on again, I hit buzz, and I can see that I can see it buzz in here. So then I could just easily click in, you know, player number one buzzed in. I never have to leave this app here, and all of this could be happening on a separate device. So that ccg.buzz uh, CCG forward slash show is our little hidden trick to all you quiz show people out there. Show, see that show, show. Uh, you can use this. Uh, it makes it a whole lot easier if you're playing on Zoom or if you're playing uh, even at a live event to have somebody else just turning those buzzers on and off. That way you can just focus on the game and someone else can focus on those buzzers for you. Sometimes you gotta do it all by yourself and it's possible, but if you can have someone else help you with that, it's really, really, really nice. So, and then again, just as a reminder, with the logo screen on, you can then check your buzzers, make sure they're all working if you're using wired buzzers. And we really uh, we really uh, like the, the, the buzzer at affordablebuzzers.com, so go check them out. But if not, just go to ccg.buzz and you can be playing with your crowd right now. All right. I uh, hope this helps. If you have any questions, let us know, and we will see you guys later.